Hey loves, as promised, um, we are doing a part two to the winter visit outfits of the weekend of the day. I don't know what to call it. I used to call it visit outfit of the day, um, but that's when I would do one outfit at a time. You could see all of those past ones in my old videos. I don't know. It's like six years old. So some of those styles might be over at this point, but I haven't figured out a new name for the series about winter outfits. But anyway, um, as I said in my first video where I posted my five or six different visit outfits that I will post up there in the YouTube cards, you guys can click on it and watch it. I got tons of great feedback on that. A lot of people got outfit inspiration from that video. But I said in there we were going to do a part two and we were going to feature our members, their outfits and where they got their stuff from as well. So you could see videos from people with different style, with different body types, who live in different climates and who do go to different types of facilities levels of like you know what you can wear with the rules and differences that way we have girls who can wear leggings I can't all the way to girls who could wear um who have to cover everything up including their collarbones so without further ado here are their visit outfits um and I think we're going to continue to do this in the future and feature our members in our videos because why not um let's all hang out and get to see and know each other so um enjoy Susan's dress is from New York and Company. The shoes are from DSW and the scarf is from Charming Charlie's. Girl, I am in love with your style and I want to raid your closet. In this photo, her jacket is from Peebles. The jeans are from Hollister. The black shirt is from Walmart and the boots are from Dillard's. Check out these kick ass boots. I need to get myself a pair. For this visit, Angela was wearing a shirt from Target for 15, the shirt from Boutique Shop for 10, and the jean leggings are the ultra high stretch from Gap Factory for $35. This is a $6 shirt from Walmart that I feel like I need. It is so sunny and bright and adorable. These jeans are the same as before from Gap Factory, and she's wearing sandals from Gap Factory that got cut off. I'm not quite sure where Angela got this shirt, but it's beautiful and so boho. So I'll ask her to post in the comments below where she got it so all of us who feel like we need it can get it. <laughs> the shirt is from Jane.com for $14. The jeans are the Gap Factory high stretch leggings again, and she is wearing her babies, she calls them her Adidas All Stars. They were $75. Crystal got her dress at Ross's in New Jersey for $20 when he was in Fairton and she stayed for a week. Girl, I love me a good sweater dress and this one hugs your curves perfectly. What a beautiful. Sasha says that Nike sweaters are her go-to comfy, warm, and cute and she really does look adorable in this picture. I think she's wearing Van sneakers, which I am dying for a pair. She paired them so adorably. Petra got her cardigan from Walmart for $5, the scarf from Old Navy B for $9, and the tank from Kato's for $8. I am in love with the colors in this outfit. Oh my God, I need to recreate this. Crystal got this sweater at Walmart for $15 and the jean leggings she got there for $10. What a sweet, adorable, comfy, and warm outfit. Perfect for the winter. Nicole got this beautiful dress from Marshalls. I love how she paired it with that necklace. And also, this is a little black dress that you can wear so many more times than just visit. It's so versatile. In this photo, she's wearing the Shirley sweater from LuLaRoe. The V-neck is from Mod Cloth, and the leggings are from Maurice's. Look how cute those shoes look with this outfit too. Love the coordination. I believe this is another Lula Row dress, but I'm not exactly positive and I didn't see where she posted where she got everything from, but I love the way she belted it. I love these colors together and I love how comfortable and still beautiful. I believe Lisa's outfit here is from the Time and True brand at Walmart. I believe she said the top and the jeans were from there, but she can come in and correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. Here's a close up of this outfit. So fall and adorable, very chic. And you can see here the jeans are riders from Lee. For this visit, Lisa wore a top from Walmart for $5.94, jeans from Walmart for $19.94, and the boots are from Target for $39.99. They look so warm. Nellie didn't say where exactly she got her outfits from, but I love this white on white or the light on light pastel look. I love winter whites. I think it's beautiful. Even though she didn't say where she got her outfits from, obviously this windbreaker is from Nike, and I'm loving this casual chic look. I have not perfected that look myself, so I'm going to have to recreate this. Like I said before, I love a good sweater dress, but I also love a belted dress to show off that curves and to cinch the waist and to really, really define that beautiful feminine body. I love this. Destiny said this is one of her favorite looks for winter, just a simple sweater, leggings, and high boots. And if you can't wear leggings to visit, just pair it with jeans. It'll still look just as cute. And our final look is from our beautiful international member, Zoe. She got her shirt from eBay for six euro, and the jeans are from a shop in London called New Look for 12. You guys keep staying strong, keep loving strong, keep supporting one another through this journey because you're one day closer to it all being behind you. Lots of love from my heart to yours. 
I will see you beautiful men and women in the next one. But in the meantime, keep um, posting your visit outfits and letting us know where you get them from so we can all inspire one another. And if you're interested in shopping my closet, you can find my um, link on Poshmark right up here. I'll post it in the cards and you can, um, sorry, I'm getting distracted. There's people walking around the car. This lady's like looking. Remember this happened last time when the old man, I'll post that up there too. When the old man um, knocked on my window because he wanted to know what I was doing, but he was like, I like your car. Um, very funny. But anyway, um, you can get $5 off for signing up under Poshmark using that link and you can shop my closet. If there's anything you see in a video and it's not up there because I've been really slow to post pictures, I just have way too much going on. Just send me an email and we could talk about um, getting our stuff up there and let's follow each other's closets. And it's a great way to share visit outfits without spending a lot of money. And all of the money that I make in Poshmark goes directly back to SPWF, the nonprofit. So that is one way that you can donate to SPWF as well as you can just donate. I will put a link up there as well. Lots of links today. After I say goodbye. Love you guys.